Hey friends. All right. So we are going to take our polar bear and we are going to use a black oil pastel to trace everything. And then we're going to use a special trick to kind of create some shading. Because if you watch the video, polar bears don't really have white skin, right? So we don't want him to be, you know, super, super white and kind of just boring. We want him to come to life a little bit and give him a little bit more shading, as we call it, in the art world. So what we're going to do is we are going to trace pretty much everything, okay? And we're gonna be that carefully. Um, as we do that carefully, we're gonna make sure not to touch things that we've already done um, because we don't wanna get little spots everywhere, okay? So I'm gonna work, because I'm right-handed, I'm gonna work left to right, moving across my page this way. Because if I were to work this way, I would accidentally cross back over and smudge again. So I'm gonna start, I'm not gonna do the pause yet because I like to kind of hold my paper um, so I'm going to go over the back first, and I'm going carefully, trying to make sure that I get right on the money, and I'm pressing kind of hard. Okay, and now I'm going to call, and inside I'm going to do the ears next. My oil pastel got stuck a little bit. All right, and then I'm gonna go ahead, and I'm gonna connect this top part here, and then I'm gonna work my way around. Now there's a reason why I'm not doing that middle of the face. See how my hand would be touching it right now? And then I'm gonna come and finish the other side this way. So kind of meet back in the middle. Okay, I kind of clean that up just a little bit because I was a little bit off. All right. I'm going to skip the bottom. I am going to focus on the face right now. So for the face, we are going to fill in the eyes, but I'm going to leave a little tiny dot of white in there. So you got to kind of be careful and use the edge of your oil pastel. So I'm going to leave just a little tiny dot of white, but the rest I'm filling in. Just like so. And you can already kind of see our polar bear come into life a little bit more. All right, and then I'm going to trace over his nose, or his snout, I should say. And then this mouthpiece. And then we're going to fill in that nose the whole way. It's going to be nice and black. Polar bears have that rich black nose. All right, so now I can go ahead and come down here and do the um, feet. So you can also turn your paper if it makes it easier so you don't have to. I don't like to work like at the bottom of my paper. I get kind of stuck. So I'm going to go ahead and turn it, make it a little bit easier for me to trace. And again, I'm tracing everything. Tracing everything. Sometimes you can catch the edge of your paper too, and that kind of stinks, so be careful. So I've got one, two, and three feet there. All right, so I have traced my polar bear. Now what's my magic trick? Well, my magic trick really has to do with um, your finger. That's it, that's it, that's my secret, is one finger. Uh, you know what, but I did realize that we missed one thing. We're gonna come back in here, and I'm gonna do a, a basically a small ear inside of an ear. So I'm gonna just draw it, and I'm gonna do it freehand. I'm not gonna do pencil first, just like so, okay? Because that's gonna be important in a second. All right, so you're gonna take that one finger, and what we're gonna do is we are basically going to drag our finger inward all the way around our back of our polar bear. So I'm gonna turn my paper because it's easy for me to pull down, and then as I go, I'm gonna rotate my paper around, okay? So I'm gonna start here at the bottom, and I'm putting my finger on that black line and I am pulling it towards the middle. But I'm not pushing out, I'm only pushing in. But we are gonna cut these out, so if you get a little smudgies around the outside edge, that's okay. And I'm gonna kinda go back over some areas if I don't feel like it's working, because maybe I just didn't get enough oil pastel on the paper. 
And if you do feel like it's not working that much, go over your paper again because you just might not have gotten enough oil pastel on there. So I can retrace and then drag again. So I'm going all the way around and it's kind of not showing up super great on the camera. Let me see if I can bring it a little bit closer so you can see. So it's going to just add some subtle shading to that texture of your polar bear's fur as we go around. And I'm gonna add a little bit more on this side. So again, just retrace with my oil pastel carefully. And then I'm just using that one finger. Okay, so if I look at my finger, I do have a dirty one, but the rest of them are clean. I'm not using my entire hand because we don't want to get our paper super messy, okay? So I'm going to do the same thing for this leg, but we've got to go inside. So I'm pulling the other direction. Okay, so the inside of our leg here, whoop. And there's definitely some shading underneath the legs here. So I'm actually gonna add a little bit more black right here and really use that to kind of pull the shading from under the legs of my polar bear there, okay? Oh, I dropped my oil pastel, oops. Okay, so the next thing we're gonna do shading wise is um, we're gonna fill in the ear. So that inner ear portion that we created today, you're just going to kind of smudge, smudge, smudge all the way in so it turns kind of gray. Okay. And then you're going to do a little tiny bit on the outer ear. Just a little. I'm just using the tip of my finger a little bit to smudge it. Okay. Now on the face, um, we're going to go, let's go to the mouth area. We're going to do the same thing we did for the inner ear. And we're just going to kind of rub and smudge so that becomes gray and a little bit more dirty in that section. Okay. And then um, for the only place that we're going to do something a little bit different is we're going to look at the nose here. And we're actually going to smudge outward a little bit to create some depth because the nose, you know, sits away from the face a little bit more. So do it that way. I'm gonna add a little bit here. It looks like I lost a little oil pastel in that corner. All right. And then I know it's kind of hard to see, but I promise that I'm doing it. It's so hard with white paper to see that detail. Okay, so you can see those kind of streaks and you should be able to see it on your own paper. So I just went out from the nose, a little bit different than what we had been doing. And then I'm gonna go ahead and smudge just a little bit around the nose area. If you think about animals, they never have super clean faces. It's always a little bit dirty. Okay, and then the last thing uh, on this head area is we're gonna go ahead and go around the outside. So I'm pulling towards the body around the outside of the head. There we go. All right, I'll bring it closer so you can see a little bit again. So it's just a little bit and I, I swear the camera doesn't do it justice. I will take pictures and the photo will look much nicer. All right, and then the last thing is for our feet. Go ahead and pull inside. So inside the line, just with your finger, smudge, smudge, smudge. Inside, all the way around. And then I'm gonna just kind of swipe over the toes. Okay, that's it. We've got our polar bear, we've got it nice and smudged. Go ahead and go wash your finger and we are done for today. Nice job, guys.